Hey YouTube, I'm DJ Big B and today I'm going to be helping you learn how to connect your Pioneer DDJ SB or any power USB controller right to Virtual DJ. It takes about 30 seconds to do right before a gig. A lot of my friends are struggling with it so I said hey, let's make a video. So I hope it helps you out YouTube. Okay YouTube, we're at the computer so the first thing you want to do is download Virtual DJ. I'll eventually make a video on how to do that. But it's easy to do, so all you do is open Virtual DJ. So this is the first step. Once you're on the Virtual DJ, unpack your controller, and I'll show you the next step. Okay, you two, now we're on the step two. You have your controller hooked up right to the computer, no problems. Sometimes when you get to this page, we're going to have a little white box come up and say, new device found. You click OK. Then you take your mouse. Where's my mouse? There it is. Say, hi, mouse. You click on this little round tool thingy then you're going to come up to a screen. On this screen you want to highlight speakers plus headphones and highlight Pioneer DGS, DG, DDJSB and hit apply. You also want to go down here to licenses. You're going to want to click login and you're going to want to log into your virtual DJ account. Virtual DJ is not free. It's a $20 a month subscription or you can unlock the whole pro program for about $300. But I pay by month. Then you just hit apply. Go back to audio, hit apply, and everything should work. Now, if nothing moves, let's try it out. We have things moving. Now, if nothing's moving when you're using your controller, I usually just exit virtual DJ, relaunch, no problems. So, we just connected a controller to virtual DJ in about 20 seconds. Let me show you how it works. So, stay tuned, YouTube. Just to show you everything does work, YouTube, we're going to hit play. And it's going. See? It's that easy, YouTube. Everything's run off of one wire. One wire to the computer in less than 30 seconds. You just have to log in and hit apply. Awesome. The video helped you learn how to connect your Pioneer DDJ SB USB power controller up to Virtual DJ or any Pioneer controller that runs off a USB wire works the same way. Um, above this shoulder here, you can watch the review for the SB. And above this shoulder, you can watch a review for my favorite Behringer speakers. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, please post them below YouTube. Thanks for your help and support. Subscribe.